I came out to many different people over many years and it never really ends. Around the time I was 10, I came out to my mom and she was like, it's just a phase, but it's been five years. So. Um, I had a very, very uh, strict religious upbringing and it wasn't okay. And I was prepared to know, like, I may never talk to my parents again after this phone call, but this is something I need to do. I need to be able to be who I am. I think some part of me always knew that I was gay because when my parents would say something about those faggots on in the parade or on the news or something, and I'm like, but they're just people, Mom. They're just people, Dad. Because of the town we live in and the kind of people we have here, their biggest concern was my safety. My parents are very accepting people. They're like very liberal leaning. And they're like, you know what? That's none of our business. You can do whatever you want. And I'm very grateful to have such understanding parents. It's better to show your authentic self instead of hiding who you truly are. Not only is it mentally draining. This is who I am. And I mean, I'm many things. My sexual orientation, gender identity are just part of it. And so it was very liberating to be able to be honest with my parents. I came out 100% and I made the decision to live 100% authentically when I was about 20. And that was when I moved to Alaska and I had a new start and decided that I was going to be me. We love you.